The wait for Marvel's Spider-Man is excruciating, but we got a glimpse of Insomniac's new epic action adventure at Comic-Con this week. The new story trailer revealed another major Spider-Man character, and new hints about the challenges facing Peter Parker and his allies. Here's everything that you might have missed in the new trailer. The big news is that Silver Sable is joining Spider-Man's already massive cast of characters. It appears that Sable and her mercenary force are being hired by Mayor Osborn to help keep the peace in New York City. Sable looks to be a recurring foe for Spidey in the game, but if this story is anything like the comics, expect the two to put aside their differences before the end. Speaking of Osborn, the trailer makes it clear that he and Peter already have an established history in this universe. In fact, one scene seems to suggest that Osborn walks in on an unmasked Spider-Man. As far as we can tell, the trailer is being misleading here. It looks more like two separate scenes have been spliced together. Even so, expect Peter's existing relationship with the Osborn family to make his costume struggles that much more complicated. Spidey's allies Mary Jane Watson and Miles Morales get plenty of face time in this new trailer. One thing that's still not clear is whether Miles has spider powers and whether we'll actually see him suit up. As for MJ, she's clearly not afraid to get her hands dirty. One scene shows off what looks to be a playable sequence where she infiltrates the Osborn Tower. Osborn is accompanied by some of Mr. Negative's guards, suggesting the two villains are working together. MJ even encounters a captive spider that could very well be connected to the one that gave Peter his spider powers in the first place. Could this be the key to Miles, or even MJ herself, gaining powers during the course of the story? The trailer also includes several brief glimpses of other major Spider-Man villains. We see Mr. Negative, Rhino, Electro, Vulture, and Scorpion. Finally, while most of the scenes in the trailer feature Spider-Man in his redesigned costume, one scene spotlights the classic Spider-Man skin instead. Will there be a story-based reason for Peter switching to his old duds? Did we miss anything in the new trailer? Let us know in the comments below. And keep it locked to IGN all weekend for plenty more Comic-Con.